But if you look at the Eurozone as a whole, uh, the debt levels collectively are, are not really um, as great. But what the Europeans are really worried about is uh, just uh, what you have uh, pointed out here, is that it's the contagion effect from the United States. So if the US loses its AAA uh, rating, what about France? And now what about Germany? Um, we already have seen within the Eurozone contagion from the Greek crisis spilling over into Italy. Lots of questions now about Spain. And the Spanish are extraordinarily concerned in particular about this now. They were already on the brink of um, basically having the markets uh, respond to um, some real serious structural problems in the, the Spanish economy. And there's certainly a feeling um, in, in a strange way of double standards in Europe that the, the, the crisis this time around was made in the United States, the subprime mortgage. It's had all these knock-on effects. It's the United States that's been uh, downgraded because of its uh, political dysfunction. It's the United States that seems to have uh, the largest debts. And at the same time, mm -hmm. when there's a downgrade uh, by S&P, where the markets uh, flee to is the United States, just as is uh, being pointed out. And in much of the commentary that we've seen, um, some of the uh, US uh, analysts have said, well, you know, it's not so bad. Look who we're competing for with uh, the world, the dysfunctional Europe and equally dysfunctional Japan. Uh, so the West, uh, we're doing a good job of tarnishing ourselves, the brand West, uh, not just uh, the uh, United States. So the fears in Europe at the moment are this, is this one's of perceptions.